Why am I writing in LA? Um, well, I've been, tra I've been traveling for so long now, I don't really know what is home anymore. So, um, you might say Holland is my home. I mean, my family lives there, like my mom and dad and brother and my dog. Very cute dog. But um, it's not like I like that's when I go back home it's not like oh I'm finally home again I love Holland it's, it's beautiful but LA is just man the sun is so nice and the, I mean if you walk around this area it's just all kinds of flowers and, and the, the weather is just yeah. everything to me yeah and you mentioned like here the music that you write is affected by your surroundings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Music I write is definitely affected by your surroundings. And, you know, this record we're working on is going to sound like this place. Probably going to look like this place. Like the wood, the, 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 the organic vibe of it all. It's not really a modern place. It's kind of old. Old interior. I like it a lot. And all the guitars you're going to hear on the, on the, on the album are going to be recorded. Like we're recorded in this room, you know, the acoustic guitars, for example, I don't know where they are. Acoustic guitars, when you record acoustic guitars, they, you also record the room. You know, if I were to record it outside, it would sound different. If I were, would record it at, in Holland, it would sound different. This is just, just like the energy flowing here. It's just energy, recording energy. Recording energy and recording pain and just real things. You don't get that when you, when you just. I love digital instruments and like MIDI, and, but there's something magical about real instruments and actually recording sounds that you know, you can't get that in a digital world. Yeah. Because it's. I, it, just, it just makes everything so sentimental, you know. Yeah. Like there's a gate that it closes every, like when someone enters this, the garden, you hear the gate squeaking yeah. and every time we hear the squeaky noise we all look outside yeah. that's special that's what sound does to you okay I'm going to record it both in there oh the sound's falling into place I'm just gonna walk wait 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 I want to record the Come with me I want to record the fence yeah, no, we'll literally, we'll just go together. We'll walk okay. together and we're just gonna walk around Echo Park. I'll walk, open the gate so it's not too close. Yeah, you go like a meter in front of me. acoustic guitar and I've always wanted to like, I, I know we're in the EDM realm of things but I've always been a huge fan of, of bands and I've played it 
played in bands myself before. I love putting new things or like expanding genres with, with stuff that's not there yet. And I think we're, we're, we're doing something something interesting where we, we're putting like a lot of acoustic guitars in these kind of electronic driven songs. So, so the sound is very, even more organic than album one, I think. It, it, it's even more, even more real instruments and it's like stuff that breathes and breathes. When you try to play a guitar part and you can't play it and you're struggling and you're trying to make it sound right but like you struggling you kind of hear that in the recording you know that like you you feel the the pain and yeah that's what i want to capture that that's i feel like so much stuff i hear so much stuff i hear these days it's just so polished and so perfect and yes it's a nice song but other than that doesn't touch me most of the time. guitar and the couch and this it's just I don't know why it just feels like I think album two is gonna sound like the way this looks so this is our studio we've definitely upgraded since last time <laughs> not <laughs> same speakers same microphones so I live here yes so I'm Tim and I've been so, my name is Tim, um, and I've been long-time friends with Son. I think for about 15 years, a bit longer now. How did you guys meet? In high school. We played in a band together, which I'm not gonna name. <laughs> <laughs> so, what I do here is to make sure Rutger and Son can write as efficiently as possible, and when they want to record, I'm just there to engineer them basically, make sure everything gets recorded at the right moment. Ah, ah. <laughs> Tapey. Haley, do you have tapey? I don't have tapey. We can make this work. Yeah, we will. But we have no extra money. No, that will figure out. I'll find some. I need some tape, guys. Is that tape? Yes, I already love this idea. I need like 16 layers. Get your hand out of it. The best episode in porn take. Professional recording music studio. <laughs> yeah, let's go. One more time. Baby. Baby, do you realize? Uh, people uh, <laughs> who had nausea when they try to say my name or 
a little bit of vomit comes out. <laughs> so, uh, but that is my name. But so I don't. I, I respond to Rutger or Rut here. And rat. Rut. Rat. Rent car is something some people. Uh, what? Like really? Rutger. Rent car. Rent car. Yeah, Rent car. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm good friends with uh, with Sondler for quite some years now. We used to play guitar, both of us, in in, a, in an old band, which is where we. Uh, met and that was really fun and then I asked him to help me with some songs that I was working on and I think we found a, a lot of common love for sounds for sounds and songs. I think, yeah. Nothing here is black or I don't like it, I don't like it. Son, this, I can do better, man. I know I can. Yeah, do better. No, that that's that's almost as bad. I I I, I can almost not believe that I played that. Let's do another one. <laughs> We're done here. Yeah, Rucker is like like you could hear a sound. You know, like. Those two sounds are so different from each other to us, mm -hmm. but maybe for someone else it would be just like, oh, it kind of sounds the same. But for us it's like, yeah, yeah, a complete different song, you know. And yeah. and I don't know a lot of people that are so passionate about uh, the sonics or sounds. That's that's Nicholas. No, Rutger. Red car. That's red car. I never had a fig before like this in my life. I only had dried figs in the supermarket. But you can tell that they're ripe if they're like bursting. How do you know this? The owner of the Airbnb told me. Don't you want to wash it first? Yeah. No. I'm going to wash it first. <laughs> well, I mean... One of the best I've had. This one was ready for it. Yeah, mm. so the, the thing is, is you you can't have them hang there for too long because then the birds will get them, and then, uh, which is great for the birds. So, <laughs> so cool. All these little sample keyboards, they're all special in their own way. This actually is a sampler. This is from the owner from the Airbnb. First day, he was like, oh, so you guys make music, right? I've got this old sampler. This is an Insonic EPS 16 Plus. It's super lo-fi. You can record sounds in there and then make it sound really low quality. Like... You know what I mean? It's, sounds need to cry, you know? In order for me to feel them.
like it. I like it a lot. Did you see that? Did you see the bird there? Did you look? Dude, it's crazy. There's a bird on the, the painting on the on the on the window there. Mm -hmm. It's got the bird and it's also it also has the freaking spectrum behind the bird. I'll show you. It's almost like it's like it's like we're meant to be here. I don't know if I believe that, but it's definitely special. Is that crazy? <laughs> it's so beautiful as well. If I look in it, in a see it's expensive, but it's not worth it. Super fat thing. Kijk, het zijn goede. Ik vind dat die die eigenlijk niet goed zijn. Zou wel mooi zijn als het. Are you scared of all these changes? When you're scared of all these changes, when you're scared of all these Let it sink in. What if you did say? When you're scared of all these changes and you're trying to hold on tight, did it did it better did it then I hope you realize. Time is moving fast. It's very good. Play again? Sing it. One, two, everybody fucking jump. Even if you hold on tight. I don't know why I'm out of breath, but I am. Maybe, maybe because you're sitting the way you are. <laughs> I'm like the ideal seat. Time is moving fast, but we can make this moment last. Sick. Time is moving fast. I said it. I said it. You ready? We can make this moment last. Time is moving fast, but we can make this moment last. It's cool. We could, yeah, we could, or we could make, we could. Time is moving fast, but we can make this moment last. Time is moving fast, but we can make this moment last. We can make this moment last. Like, Ooh, that's how good, yeah. Are you feeling like a stranger? When, ev when everyone passes. Every everybody's passing by. Everybody's passing by. No, yeah. Everyone. I know it's. I, I got it. Give it. I got it. Give it. Whatever it is that you're chasing, I hope you realize. Time is moving fast, but we can make this moment Fuck. last. But what, whatever it is you're chasing, <laughs> whatever it is you're chasing, I hope that you read it. <laughs> That's it. Whatever it is you're chasing, I hope that you realize. Time is moving fast, but we can make this. That's it. Record that thing. Recording sounds is so special, right? It's yeah. like if you think of it, you record some a moment in time. You record a moment. Yeah. Like that. Just having me on camera now. Yeah. We'll always be there. But that, but like you just said, when you have a video you can see exactly what happened. But sound, you can imagine it. Challenges the imagination. Challenges the imagination. That's what I like about writing with with the Nicholas because you know, we're writing songs that I feel like you can imagine a lot of things with, you know, like when we write lyrics and when we write songs, we, we want to keep a bit of that imagination part alive. Jeff, I got a question, Jeff, or grammar question. So I've just got a lyric and it's like this. I know you feel like a stranger watching everyone pass by. Is that correct? Or should it be, I feel like a stranger, no, 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 passing by. Everybody's passing by, you know, like because I want the, the, the tense to be good. This guitar, it's a Martin, 
This is a very moody guitar. Some, like some days it will sound good and some days it won't. I want to find a guitar that I like every day and not just some days. I like this guitar on, on certain days. When I look for a new guitar, I, I play one chord like... And I know right away if it's the guitar or not. With this guitar, back then I had it. I was, I was like, wow. Like I didn't know it was so moody, you know? Like, We're filming something, is that okay? <laughs> like, of course. What do you guys need? How, how have you been uh, experiencing these, these last couple of weeks? It's been really nice. I don't know. I feel like we kind of went at it pretty hard right yeah. from the bat. Ride something every day. Yeah. And now I'm just taking a shower, cleaning <laughs> up. Cool. This is his guitar. It is the best guitar I've ever heard in my life. And he knows it. He knows I want it. And he loves that he has the better guitar. To buy it from him. I, I've asked, he's always said no. But this guitar is always great. It sounds, I don't even have to fucking tune it. It just sounds amazing. A special instrument, it like when it inspires you to write something new right away. I, I don't know what that was, but it sounds. Like... Look who's here, bitches! Hey, Ooh. who's here? Door? What? Nothing. Who's here? I thought you'd come tomorrow. No, I got to you know here. Yo, where is it? Not coming. Come on. Who is that? <laughs> yes, my name is Thorwald. I founded Bitbird with Son a couple years back. I'd say four years now. Um, in the project here, I'm a creative director. So for this project especially, I think it started with album one where we um, got into a little house. Um, at Festo Avenue and kind of try to capture the spirit of the place that the album was written in and for this one that we're doing right now we even want to go deeper into that concept because it's such an inspiring place where we're at such an inspiring um, environment that I just really want to capture everything that's going on here um, because I know San draws a lot of inspiration from the place that we're at and I want to do the same visually so I'm just trying to collect as much elements from this place so we can make the project breathe this place. Dude, also new, you can, you can call the track new one because time is, one. Is the it's one so, one. You know what I mean? New one. Also I mean, a new would, song. And it's also another song because we already had a track together. It's yeah, like yeah, a new yeah. one. Yeah. Song I love by For the Sunshine. New one. <laughs> this is insane. <laughs> so this is that magic. Stop checking the time. Every second is a new one. I remember when we were working on this song. Yeah. With By Polar Sunshine. He literally came in and he heard it and the first five minutes he just grabbed the mic and was like Why are you trying to hide? You can't do awesome. The melody of it all? Yeah. He sang this, something like this. Why are you trying to hide? You can do whatever you want Stop checking the time Every second is a new A picture with, with, it, with this guy right here. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> the shit you can capture in photos. Lightly looks better in slow mo. Don't wanna wait for tomorrow. I like to say the
<coughs> the first time I listened to the demo, I was like, it sounds great, but I feel like uh, it needs to have like an essence of live about it. Yeah, like, I feel, you like you feel like you're fucking saying it. Yeah. I want. Uh, oh yeah. I wanna live my life in overdrive I wanna live without regrets and lies You wanted time You had no time You wanna feel You only have time to feel This is the time of your life <laughs> I got, I got so nauseous for one second. Oh, why? Because of the hangover. So? Yeah. I know what you need. Because there's a guitar in your life. You need another guitar. I need some more guitars in my life, dude. That's the cure. Yeah. <clears throat> Today, I deserve a new guitar. I actually bought this guitar a couple of months ago, and I was very happy with it, but I think and there might be something better out there, like this guy's guitar. <laughs> yeah, so we're only bringing this because we're trying to find something that's better than this guitar. <laughs> yeah. We won't find it. We will. Maybe, maybe as good as. I, I'd, I'd be happy. I feel like you shouldn't look for the same, you should look for something good that's different. Because we already have this guitar in there. No, you have that guitar. <laughs> <laughs> It's not it. 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 Yeah, it's literally just been like waking up, making music eating, sleeping, and making music again. And look at this, it's just, I don't know what it is, this place, I feel so, feel so alive, so vibrant here. I think it has to do with um, all the nature, all the nature, all the green, all the flowers that, that's just on the streets randomly here. It's also very convenient. You can walk for 10 minutes and then you're at like a coffee coffee shop at the mall. If you want to be in downtown LA, you just drive for 15 minutes and you're in the middle of it. Crash on the floor. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Everything's very spontaneous, which I like a lot. And I think it definitely benefits the, the songs that are being made at the moment. It hurts. It hurts. Woo! Hey! It hurts. Hey! This guy hurts. Woo! Woo! Okay, let me do off the uh, atmosphere. One more time. I realized about one of my relationships it was really bad at times but I think it was definitely one of the realest things love wise I felt because I guess you argue because you care right and you you know yeah sometimes pain can be a beautiful thing yeah I think I on album one I it still ended up cleaning a lot of things up very nicely and with album two, I, I, I'm gonna force myself not to do that, just to, you know, keep 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 the pain intact. You know, if I'm playing a part and I can't really play it, you're like, <laughs> leave some of that stuff in. Yeah. Or like the background, or if there's a lot of noise in the background or in the microphone and the recording, I'm just gonna leave it in. And we actually did a lot of vocal recording sessions that were just a couple of takes, and that was it. Yeah. It's a very corny to say, but things can definitely be perfect in their imperfection. Okay, that's it on my take. Coffee. Let's get coffee in LA. Coffee, coffee in LA. Maybe we're the same. Maybe 
Thank you, Nelly. I remember after the album one tour, I booked an Airbnb in LA in Echo Park and uh, I entered the Airbnb and it was just so quiet because it was in the Echo Park, like in the hills, you know, and uh, I was just so sad because I felt so, for, for months we had been surrounded by people and, and then suddenly you're in LA, which you think, like, if you think about LA, you think of like craziness and like, wow. But then to be there in that Airbnb with complete silence around you made everything feel so significant, insignificant. Yeah. It was just... Dude, I had the same feeling. Yeah? Yeah. such a different perspective on what it's like to be you know a traveling artist and all the struggles that come with that and um, kind of allows me to yeah, just have a better understanding of what it's like um, so I can with the label um, do a better job of communicating with the artist in a way that makes them feel way more comfortable because we're way more aware of what's happening but also it's just a beautiful opportunity for me to connect with the fans as well and see what they're doing creatively like on the spot you know how they experience the shows because i have a big vision for everything that's to come you know events and stuff so i want to be able to give them all the best experience they can like in a safe environment having a lot of fun um, and it also just boosts my creativity to see all that like i take so much from that yeah, it's beautiful it Special. It's just special. Mm. That's it. Oh. Sick, right? Mm. 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 M
crazy. Ja, ik kan echt goed dat nadoen. Ga ik ga ja? snel. Ga je het trompetje doen? Ga het trompetje doen, ja. Oh, uh, lauw. Ja, man. Ja. Nee, eens komen ze plots af. Ik hoor het nog niet echt over mijn kop verstroelen. Godverdomme, thanks. <laughs> Wat zeg jij? Ik was dan communiceren met die jongen. Dit is de hit man of the album. Dit is de hit. Ik ben er man. I'm gonna eat my shoes. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what, what month is it? It's 2019. <laughs> <laughs> Your name is Sander, artist project name is Sanholo, and you're making a record. such a fun track to play live. Mind again. Ah! Ah! 
If there was a way, I would go back. If there was a way, I would go back. Performance of a lifetime. Thanks, man. Okay, tell me nice please. And again, say you've changed, I've changed. Okay, ready? You've changed! I've changed! You've changed! It's not the same! Cool, it's already clipping? Oh, it's pretty good. Yeah, that's right. Let it clip, you've man. Changed. Just kidding, don't. So I had all my friends come out to the Airbnb to sing. You've changed, I've changed. DM'd like this this kombucha company on nee. Instagram and he was like nee. Yeah we love your kombucha and we're working on San's record. Nee. And then they were like for sure. Amazing. Even ice there's ice, an ice wow. pack. What? They are kidding. Wow. Because all kombucha is created. Look at that. That's so nice. American football is such a legendary band. Um, some of their songs have a very special place in my heart. Very, very special place. You know when you hear a song and it takes you back to a very specific moment in your life? Their entire first album, which is so iconic, does that for me. My guitar playing is definitely heavily influenced by, by them. They're like 
I feel like they're the godfathers of the twinkly guitar stuff. It's all very clean and very twinkly and, and, and um, yeah, shiny. I, I don't know how to describe it, but it's, it's very, uh, I think twinkly is, is a good way to describe it. And the fact that they were willing to work on this song with me is, is crazy to me. Um, it's just special. I can't really find the right words, but, but the entire thing is just, uh, it's very special to me. Don't worry, whatever happened, you're never even ever leaving. You're a fucking tattoo. The pain is waned, the ink's still bleeding. Do I need to get through that last line faster or something? Or I love it, dude. It's okay. fucking is it pain is waned or pain has waned? Or is it? The pain has waned. Do you want to say it like that? Or <laughs> What am I saying? Pain is waned? The pain has waned is what it is. Yeah, pain has waned? Yeah. Let's do that again, okay? Mm -hmm. Tattoo. The pain is waned, the ink's still bleeding. Yeah, fucking it kind hell. of like, yeah. it's, the has it is, it's just the pain's waned almost. That's good. The pain's way. I could be like, the pain's way. I could say the pain's waned. Or is it, the pain is waned. The pain is waned. The pain has waned. This sounds good to me, the okay. pain is waned. Yeah, the okay. pain is waned. Okay. I mean, this can't be the final tech, but okay. I like, I'm just gonna piece it. To me, to me it is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and it's my fucking song. <laughs> Different direction, but kind of cool. Because, <laughs> hold on. Because it's sort of like this one part is in seven, doesn't fit. It's like its own little thing, so you get a side. And it's lost in second thoughts, lost in second thoughts. And then if you put it in the background, hold on. I'm lost in second thoughts, I'm lost in second thoughts, lost in second thoughts. It keeps happening, and chemicals. 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 As in chemicals. It's in the side, it's in chemicals. It fits good. I'm, I like your mind, man. It's, it's cool. Is it too, like, out of nowhere, though? I kind of, I mean, it's it sort of like, it would be like, you'd have to put it in there, like, reverb be like, just, like, sort of like, oh. like a, Chemicals. And chemicals. I'm lost in second, so the line would be, I'm lost in second thoughts and chemicals. Which is kind of, that's very, very dark, dark, but. I like it. Yeah, dude. I'm not sure. sure. It's cool. I like it. Yeah, it's cool. It's not romantic. It's, it's weird. Cool. Let's try this. It's just like one little repetitive thing. Dude, it's so you. I love this. Chemicals. So I had like. Yeah, hold that first. Okay. Chemical. It's cool, it's cool. It's okay, cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe give it the first one. So the part comes in, you're kind of like, oh, that's a weird little thing. No, I like this, dude. I like this. It's so beautiful. Don't you think it's beautiful? I think it's lovely. That's what's so funny is to make the word chemicals sound lovely. Yeah. It's cool because, yes, lots of second thoughts is sort of dramatic and like chemicals. <laughs> dude, fuck it. <laughs> Kijk die camera man, hij doet zijn werk goed. Kijk die camera man, hij doet zijn werk goed nu. Oh, oh, hij gaat niet in de weg. Hij 
When you work on your album, you work on so many songs at the same time. Is it easy to like let go of one idea and then focus on the next one? Oh, that's a good question. Yeah. You know, it's really hard. I, I do I do not really rest properly. I can't sleep properly before everything is done. Honestly, like I I'm constantly thinking about I gotta finish the intro. It's gonna be the outro. I still gotta work on the vocals for that song. It's a really big project in my in my head. But it's, it's, it's kind of beautiful, right? To work on something. That's why I like doing an album because albums just there's so much more depth to the entire story. It's not just a song. You can you can tell so much more with an album than you can do in one song. Yeah. You know? Yeah. There's so much more room for stuff I really want to say or sounds I really want to show. Um, but yeah, it's 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 very uh, heavy on the mind. Yeah. That's why I can't really do anything else on the side. You know, I can't really. Uh, even family, I wish I had. Like, I, yeah. Church, the, the that church probably older than LA. That, I lived here, maybe. Uh, this flat? No, not this flat. The flat right after this one. Yeah. Oh no, actually a couple flats. Yeah. Uh, I uh, I rode my bike here a lot to the studio. Yeah. Yeah. Was good? Yes. Fine. Thank you. Oh, Oh, gelukkig. Oh my baby, what baby? Look, she likes this. <laughs> Are you sure? Yeah, she likes <laughs> How old is she again? She's 11? Wow. She knows I'm filming. She's like, yes. why are you filming me? Goodbye. Sorry, bro. Uh, man. Love you. Sorry, bro. 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 My brother. <laughs> this is <laughs> so sick. This was my one of my first shows ever. Yeah? Yeah. My dad's here? <laughs> Father! <laughs> Hello, you know what? <laughs> Welcome to the studio. Yeah, we uh, we built this uh, studio with uh, I think six years ago. Yeah. With uh, mainly Tim. Sander is. Uh, <laughs> I can't build anything. <laughs> I was but, uh, just observing them. I was just like, 
<laughs> looks great. Looks great. <laughs> I remember we. What did we do? We we tried to paint this. Yes, with the with the wrong paint. And then the wrong paint, and then we had to sand it all off. Yes. And it was just like the oh. worst. He's, he's saying we, but uh, it, it it was only Tim Beast. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so you didn't do anything. <laughs> I was working. But this is uh, mainly where it all started, I think. Yeah. We, I built, we, we built this and uh, then the, the main music process of, of uh, Sander was started here. My family has always been supportive. Um, my mom was always supportive, my dad was always supportive. I got my first guitar, you know, I got my guitar lessons. Um, because they could see it really helped me, I think. Yeah. They could see it made me have a purpose. Before I did guitar or something like that, before I, uh, before I played guitar, I, uh, I just studied at school, like really hard. And I got like, like straight A's. And I would get very sad if I got like a C. And uh, I was very s afraid to fail as well. So I, every time one day, when a teacher would say, so we've got another test coming up, I would be studying for it. Um, but then I started playing guitar and that changed everything. I would still do my best at school, but it also gave me some, some other goal, you know, which was to become the greatest guitar player, which never really happened but it, it taught me a lot. Because here I don't mind the stamps as much because there's already so sort of chaos on. happening that the stamp almost makes it calmer. Up, the, up, 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 this one. Mm -hmm. I like this too, without the, without the stamp actually, with the, with the vertical. <sighs> Dude, it's a good problem to have. I know. Last time we were. This is the Dorfstraat, which is kind of a little village within this small city. Yeah. It's, I think, the oldest part of Sutermeer. This one? Yeah, this part right here is the oldest part. Look. Oh my god, is that my grandma? <laughs> it's over there. I think it's over there. So we just saw my grandma sitting right here. That's surprise her. I should spend more, some more time with family sometimes, you know? Yeah. Cause this shit, this music stuff takes so much time. Well, I also give it so much time, you know? It's, it's really my number one out of everything, which sometimes feels very selfish. Very, uh, like I'm just doing my thing. And sometimes I feel like, Things that really matter, I forget those things sometimes because I'm so focused on getting the music right, you know? I 
fucking cry. Ja, we do the vocals dan. Nou, ik, ik, toen gaat ze zelf al die vocals zetten weer. Ah! Ik hate music. I fucking hate music. Nee, Tim, ik doe het zelf wel. Ik doe het wel. I don't care anymore. That's cool. No one's gonna fuck I can literally do this with every part of the record from now on. Because that's how it goes. Like I finish it up and then I zoom in on every little part. But that's what I don't want to do. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Then let's say that I'll never look at it again. But then so something inside me it says, am I kind of like careless? No. About the project. Of course not. Because I used to be like that. For album one, I would just like go every 10 seconds of the song, see if there's something like not perfect. The thing is, you're so in it right now you've been listening to these songs for the past half year every day you just start hearing things i know i'm just scared to listen to the songs and be like oh i remember that i want to change it i can't anymore but on the other hand it's also not important at all the feeling of the song is important i should focus more on the feeling exactly. the feeling is there okay ah but it's just no but let's listen to it tomorrow one more time in in in, in general mm -hmm. and then uh then we have to cut the rope or like <laughs> now pull the plug <laughs> 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 next year and I'll put it out again. Yeah. I've changed my mind a little bit about it. You know why? What? You could die tomorrow, man. You could die tomorrow. Why not just put it all out? Put out your music that you're excited about. So we play so much that I've got to see. 
so much that Let's check how it sounds. Oh, hey, Thor. <laughs> What's it sound like? Does it sound like a phone? Is that it? What is the last thing you say? We only have one more day. I like it. Yeah, it's really cool. Hey, so we are in this beautiful Airbnb. Look at this place. It's owned by Paul. Um, he's been such a great host. He's been watching us make music and, and produce beats for weeks now. And, uh, he mentioned a couple of times that he would love to learn how to produce. He has this huge vinyl collection in his shed, like so many records. Um, and he, he would love to record those records and stuff in, in Ableton or any software, but he just didn't have the right tools. So now we're gonna make sure that he does have the right tools and, and equipment and gear. I've decided, to, I've decided to give him my old laptop, which is uh, the laptop I wrote light on and stuff so it's a it's a special little laptop okay. well we were we we're actually thinking this is this is, i wrote a lot of songs on this laptop i don't really use it anymore i was thinking of giving it to you just like as like a, i was afraid you were gonna say that <laughs> as a as a thank you for that like, is so uh, unbelievably yeah. crazy i don't even know if i can accept it no you, you should i think this is yeah, just you this is your laptop from now on uh, i wrote i wrote a bunch of songs on there and we got Ableton on there for oh you. Oh my god, you're kidding me, you know, that's amazing. That's yeah, that's no problem. And we're just gonna figure things things out. We bought a like little interface and we're gonna just help you get things like recording and stuff. I can only route people to just the music feels like a beautiful new chapter that we're gonna go in to like more live more 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 guitars more drums more real sounds yeah. I think it's an indie album with with EDM energy you know what yeah. I mean yeah, yeah. like it's songs that will make you think but also songs the same time that will make you dance right. or like go crazy or yeah. even if I wouldn't have any success or recognition or even if only five people will listen to this album I'd still I'd still do it because it's just the only way to truly express myself is through music oftentimes I I'm not able to cry about something until I wrote about it, or like made a song about it. Was it really all my
beautiful. The Eric Hyman. And Kurt. Live well. How does it sound there? What is this for? This is the crazy thing. Oh, it's a block die. It's the block die. <laughs> it's the block just die. Oh, did the block just die? No, nothing is on, dude. Did we fry it? Did we lose power? No. We did, right? No, no, something's off. Something's fishy. Professional recording music studio. <laughs> is this working? Nope. It's not working. Yeah, then we fried something. Whoa. Really? Fried rice? <laughs>